Hello everybody, welcome. We are here for another special episode on the road travels and we are at none other than Flubs Dariette. Basically just Flubs. <laughs> I don't even know why they add the thing on the end of it. Yeah. Just Flubs. That's what everybody knows it as. And it is hands down the best ice cream shop in the entire country. I don't Facts. care what anybody says. <laughs> we have tried them all. Ish. <laughs> yeah. We've tried a lot. We've tried a few. A few. A couple. But basically, uh, but we've tried all the ones in Orlando. Near Disney Universal. We've tried all the Disney and the Universal. Nothing comes close. This is the best by far. Um, and it's just an amazing place. I love it. I can't wait to show it to you. We're going to get a few delicious ice cream treats. And we'll talk a little bit about what the heck is this club place. Stay tuned. Let's talk a little bit about Flubs. It's right behind us here. This place has been in business for over 50 years and it has served the Hamilton area in Ohio. There are actually a couple of other locations. There's one in Fairfield, there's one in Spooky Nook, and I think one in Ross area in Ohio. This I think is the original though, right? This is the original, I believe. Um, although the original actually used to be that building right there that has some sort of weird dog-like creature and a plus sign on it. <laughs> But, uh, and then they built this new place right next to it and expanded and they have drive throughs and stuff now. So, um, it's a pretty cool place. 50 years. I don't care what anybody says, this place is better than the Cone. I'm just going to say it out loud. Oh, no. Let's lay it out loud. For all of you fans that love the Cone in Ohio, Todd and a bunch of other folks. Todd used to work there. Does he still work there? I don't think he still works there. Um, I do love the Cone. But Flubs... I think Flubs is better because their their like blizzard mix-in things are better here than at the Cone. But then the Cone does have a few things that this place doesn't have. So I guess depending on what you like, this is better or maybe the Cone's better. But since we like the blizzard things, I think this is better. Um, but they're also known for their fresh daily sherbets. They have all these fresh variety of sherbets. They're different pretty much every day. Sometimes they have orange and raspberry and grape, and sometimes they have blue raspberry and cotton candy and all these other ones. And their sherbets are so good, and they're made fresh. I love them. But they have tons of options. We're going to show you some of them. We'll show you why we think that they're, what do they call them? Are they, what's, it's not blizzard. Cyclone? Twisters? Whatever. We're going to show you why we think they're the best. So let's go get some ice cream. We're going to dig in and we're going to prove it to you and, you, and then you can, you can let us know by, by seeing it without tasting it. We got our stuff. And you know my favorite part about this place? Is that I get to eat all of her whipped cream. Yeah. She doesn't really like whipped cream and it comes with it, so I get to eat it. I mean, theoretically, she could just not get it. But that means that then I wouldn't get to eat it. I might get happier Sunday while I'm at it. I got butter pecan, it's the number four if you ever go to Flub Cyclone, but I got, uh, it has pecans and caramel in it, but I got extra pecans. We'll see if there's actually extra, extra pecans or not. It's good. Yeah, it has vanilla ice cream, it's soft serve. Soft serve is not my favorite ice cream, I like hand scoop actually, um, but um, this is really good. I, if I get enough toppings, I, I like the soft serve, and I do. My preference is soft serve all the way. I like soft serve way more than the hand packed, hand scooped ice cream. What about you? Same? Same? I got the Reese's. What did, wait, what did you get? Zebra? Yeah. The swirl? Rainbow sprinkles. It looks basic, but I, I don't know. It hits. I don't know what they do to it. But. Their soft serve ice cream is so good. It's better than anything. It really is. It's like this like smooth, milky i don't know how to describe it it's not like you know chick-fil-a has like that like ice, ice? Yeah. mcdonald's ice cream though honestly is good it's kind of like similar to this like how smooth it is and like just nice and sugary and lush i call it a zebra cone because i used to work at king's island when i was younger and they called the swirl chocolate and vanilla zebra so i always call them zebras and i normally hate chocolate ice cream of all sorts but I love theirs. It's so good. Um, I got the Reese's Peanut Butter Cup Cyclone. This is the medium. 
The oh. large is even bigger. What's that? The baby size? Small? That's the small. So mine, mine comes with ice cream. I got chocolate. It comes with vanilla, but I get chocolate ice cream. Then it comes with Reese's peanut butter cups all chopped up and like mixed into it, kind of like a blizzard. But then they take that and they swirl in peanut butter sauce. Then they put more peanut butter sauce on top of it. Then, you know, like, you know, like magic shell, they put that on the top, like they do like a dip top. So underneath this um, whipped cream is like a dip top, like a chocolate dip top. And then they put more Reese's peanut butter cups on there. Look at all those. And then whipped cream on top of that. This is $5.75. That's a steal. And it's huge. I'm probably not, I'm going to eat, I don't even have cooking eat it all, but I'm pretty hungry. I cannot wait to try this. I actually got extra Reese's peanut butter sauce in here. And like, I mean, there's just, so, look, at all, look at all this stuff happening here. Look at that. Check, check, check this out. Do you see all that stuff? That's just the first bite. Let's see if I can do it. <laughs> yes! Yes! Oh, yeah! Can you feel that, buddy? Huh? 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 I have exercised the demons. This house is clear. That is it! <laughs> That's so good! I don't, I don't, and you just don't, you don't even understand. The cone, the cone's good. This is it. Um, I really, I miss this kind of ice cream when we're in Florida. I do. Because the, the closest place I found, I, I will say butterbeer ice cream is phenomenal. But outside of butterbeer ice cream, there's just not a lot of great ice cream places. Friendly's is good, and I do like Friendly's. But for like a, you know, like a like kind of like a roadside ice cream shop. There's one called Swirl or something near us, which is okay. There's a big there's a big chain one down there that's horrible. Um, Dairy Queen is just eh. This is it. This is it. Five seventy five. Um, this right here at Disney or Universal would be fifteen bucks. Just saying. And just look at this place. Look, it's like it's like the middle of winter. And it's still packed. They have they, they have two lanes of traffic of people backed up to the road. In the summertime, this place will literally have cars all the way down the street. These windows will be completely full with people backed up all the way to the street. You can't even move. There's so many people. But look how many people are here just in the middle of like, it's like 50 degrees out right now. And people are coming here. It's, that's how good this place is. I mean, look at this thing. It is just absolutely loaded with stuff. Literally every bite I take has giant chunks of Reese cup in it, peanut butter sauce. Oh my gosh, it is just so good. Well, we wrecked it. We wrecked it. It was good. What did everybody think? Give us your give us your assessments. What did you it's think, Flubs? Good. It was good. I ate every bite. My stomach will, stomach will probably hurt now, but it's the best. It worth it. Ice cream ever. It, it really is the best. It's so good. So um, there you have it. If you're going to be in the area, anywhere around Hamilton, Cincinnati area, this is the place that you want to come for ice cream. I'm telling you. This is it. This is the spot. This is where you're going to want to go. Not only is the ice cream awesome here, but it's also cheap. I feel like cost effective. That's pretty much it. It's just awesome ice cream. Uh, so hope you enjoyed this episode. Be sure to tune into our next episode. Let me shake the camera a little bit more until we see you next time. The Noble Way. It's the easy way. Bye-bye, everybody.